Since 2022, the victim says she's been living in fear, never knowing what or who could be lurking around the corner. That is something that keeps me up at night, knowing uh, every time I hear an engine rev up, are they coming to get me? They know where I live. They know what I look like. The victim says it all started when a member of her family was involved in the shooting death of Darrell Palmer in May 2022. After that shooting, the victim says she's become a target of Palmer's wife, Chiquita Simpson. The victim says Simpson made multiple death threats against her and her family. The Escambia County Sheriff's Office investigated. One was, you know, you pick your teeth out from the, from the ground. Um, there were some that were implying death threats. Um, and, and again, there were, there were several of them. So there were, you know, various different threats. Uh, so much so that um, it placed the victim in well-founded fear. Social media records the victim obtained through homicide investigators shows the threats. One of them alludes to getting street justice on the victim. Another talks about spraying the victim. And another one says Simpson put a $500 bounty on the head of the victim's family members. In October 2022, the victim tells us Simpson and a group of others attacked her. After my attack, I missed three months of work. You know, I'm 48 years old. I have to fight multiple people. Sheriff Simmons says Chiquita Simpson was arrested Wednesday, charged with intimidation. She's being held in the Escambia County Jail on a $100,000 bond. Based upon the threats and based upon the fact that uh, she allegedly carried these out in the past. That was enough to submit an affidavit to the judge. Judge signed the warrant and then she was placed under arrest. The victim says she still lives in fear and she's always looking over her shoulder.